car seized by the U.S. military in France in 1939 has driven into headlines almost 90 years later. Luxury Mercedes limousine used to ferry Hitler around Germany is now up for sale. Here's a report. It's been billed as the most historically significant automobile ever offered for public sale. Why so? A 7.7-litre supercharged engine, speed of more than 160 kilometres an hour. The number plate 1A148461. The pseudonym Super Mercedes and Adolf Hitler standing in the front seat. These are the features of the 1939 luxury Mercedes limousine, which was Germany's Nazi leader Adolf Hitler's propaganda engine. It is all set to be auctioned in the US state of Arizona. It is believed that Hitler used the car on his victory parade through Berlin following the defeat of France and for a state visit by Italian fascist dictator Benito Mussolini. The car has travelled its own journey as well. After the war turned against Germany, the Mercedes was not used much and was captured by US forces who put it into a military police motor pool. Then it rubbed hands with a private owner in Belgium before being sent back to the US at North Carolina's Bureau of Veterans of Foreign Wars which used the car for parades and distinguished events. In 2002, it was sold to a European collector and then to a Russian billionaire in 2009. And now the Worldwide Auctioneers event in Scottsdale at the city's annual classic car event. I think when you look at the car, it's the most historically significant car as an artifact that there is and it's the most historically important World War II uh, item that, that there ever could be. So to take this now and use it as a positive is exactly what the owner wanted to do. Now it can be used as an educational tour, tool and, and to raise money. Word on the street is that the Hitler automobile could sell for millions of dollars and more importantly 10% of the sale price will be donated and used for education on the Holocaust as well as on how to prevent such atrocities in the future. Mirror Report, Vion.